David Padil pays heartbreaking tribute to his beloved dad after he tragically passed away. The comedian is grieving the loss of his father, who died earlier tonight, sharing the news on his social media. Paying his respects to his father, he wrote, My dad Colin Badil died earlier tonight. Thanks so much to all of you who sent unbelievably lovely messages about him in response to all my posts over the years. He leaves a huge hole in my sky. His celebrity pals were left concerned in the comments, with Vanessa Feltz writing, David the first am so sorry to hear your dad news. I wish you, Ivor and your youngest brother long life. Sending you condolences and warmest wishes. Vanessa. Favoritely commented, Oh David I'm absolutely floored by this news. Your dad was always part of the conversation. I'm pretty sure he still will be. Sorry pal. To you and your brothers and family so much love. Ex a fan added, oh, so sad for you all. I've always looked out for your posts about your dad over the last few years. Sending love and light. Oh David the first I'm so sorry. Sending love to you and yours, a fourth shared. David made a documentary, The Trouble With Dad, which aired in 2017 and looked at how he and his brother Ivor tried to care for Colin. In a blog post for Alzheimer's Research UK, David said, what happened when my dad got Pick's disease was a kind of cartooning of self, an exaggeration of who had always been. And, to some extent, this was why I thought it was okay to put him on film. This doesn't make him easy. It doesn't make the tragedy of an intelligent man having dementia any less. But it does, at least, change the narrative. It makes him a star. David previously shared his concern over his dad's health on social media. He wrote on Twitter, So my dad's had to be rushed to hospital due to a weird FK up with his catheter that I won't go into, but, still, no one can go with him, and A and E don't pick up the phone. So, basically, you just have to hope that Hess not just lying on a trolley somewhere. Sorry to be bleak. The problem is, because he has dementia, he won't know why Hess there, or how to even ask what's happening, or when he'll be seen, and... Sorry. It's such a nightmare. He went on, thanks so much for all your lovely good wishes. And yes, obviously I have faith in the doctors and nurses. But it doesn't stop you worrying, I'm afraid. Do you have a story to sell? Get in touch with us at webcelebs at trinitamirror.com or call us direct 0207 29